Prime Minister Conte addressed Parliament outlining the content of this latest decree that is due to be approved in the next few hours. As you mentioned there, uh, new restrictions might include restrictions on movement between regions, but also restrictions on bars and restaurants, uh, opening hours, and schools will be advised to offer remote learning as much as possible. We do understand as well that museums are expected to close and uh, buses are expected to run at half capacity. Capacity. And also a new curfew will be issued uh, that will begin earlier than the previous one. As we understand as well, the overall number of regions where the situation is said to be critical has increased. That means that also localized lockdowns are expected to be announced at a regional level. Georgia, there have been various protests up and down the country against the new coronavirus restrictions and the prospect of a new lockdown. Uh, I know you've been speaking to lots of people in the hospitality sector who may perhaps be the most affected. Uh, what sort of stories have they been telling you? Well, Talks, the latest process that took place today, like many others we've seen lately, was a peaceful one that had been organized by those people who have been affected by the latest restrictions. Those people don't want to surrender to the government's restrictions. They don't want to surrender to uh, new restrictions, especially when it comes to bars and restaurants opening hours. Two organizations were behind that process, representing around a thousand uh, businesses. I had a chance to speak to a few of them, but here is what one protester told me. Take a listen. Dear Prime Minister, we want to carry on working. We want all businesses to remain open as it used to be, but with new rules in place. As long as we respect the rules, the government should respect us. Is that OK? We want to work. We have mortgages, employees and taxes to pay. We've had enough. Now, uh, Chokes, given the fact that new restrictions will be approved in the next uh, few hours, they told me that this is just the beginning as more protests are expected in the next few days.